Hi, I'm Kai from Invento, and today I'll be showing you how to use the U-joint, the M8 bearing block, and the angle limiter. Let's do it. First things first, we need a profile, a profile nut. We use two positioning blocks on the U-joint, and one A M8 by 20 bolt. We secure it like this. There we go. Then we can assemble the M8 bearing block. For this, once again, we need two positioning blocks and one M8 by 20 bolt. Just wiggle it in. Yep, there we go. And secure it to the top of the profile. You can also secure this to the side of a profile, of course. For that, you just need a profile nut. To get this nice and tight, we use the Allen key handle. There we go. What we need to do next is take the angle limiter and place it on top of the M8 bearing block, like so. Now we can take the U-joint once again place it on top. Here comes the tricky part, because we need two M8 by 16 washers. Place them in the sides. There's tiny slots for them, just big enough for them to fit. Now we can fit an M8 by 60 bolt, fit it through the U-joint. And we can lock it with an M8 lock nut. and tighten it. And there we go. That's it. You can also assemble this without the angle limiter, which gives you a freer range of motion. And the process stays basically the same. There is one thing, you can also mount this sideways or upside down. And sometimes it can be hard to get in those washers. For this, we like to use a flat head screwdriver so that we can push in the tiny washers. Well, that's it. Now you know how it works. Have fun. Bye. <laughs>